Hello students, welcome to Science Learning Gateway. I hope you all are doing good. So today, in this tutorial, we will learn a simple way or the trick to memorize the first 20 elements of the periodic table. Okay, so I will tell you a very easy trick to learn the names and the symbols of the elements. From there, you will learn the atomic numbers also from 1 to 20. All the elements which are present in, present in the periodic table whose atomic number is from 1 to 20 will learn those elements. If you will learn the names of the elements in series, then you can easily write the atomic number also. So it's a very easy tr trick to learn the elements and after that you can write the atomic number. This trick is helpful for all the students who are learning in class 8th. 9th as well as in 10th if you will learn it then you can get you can score very good marks in the chemistry section as you all know that in chemistry we have the reactions formulas chemical equations and and all that and all the those things are based on the symbols if you don't know the symbol you cannot write the reaction right so we will learn the symbols as well as atomic number so it's a way so it's very important to learn the symbols and the names along with their atomic number Till class 10th, uh, only 20 elements is, first 20 element is enough for your syllabus. If you learn the first 20 elements, symbol and atomic number, it will, it will be very helpful for you to score good marks. Okay, so in this tutorial, I will tell you a trick in that we will relate the symbols of the elements to a simple monomic. Okay, memorizing the monomic help us to remember the elements in a correct order. Monomic means a simple type of poem we'll learn and according to that we'll, we'll learn the symbols of the elements. Once you know the elements, you can easily write their atomic number also. For example, 1, 2, 3 and so on. From the atomic number, you can we can get the electronic configuration. If we know the atomic number, then only we can write the electronic configuration. And if we know the electronic configuration, then we can get the valence electrons. Valence electrons will give us the valencies. If we'll get the valencies, after that we can get the properties of the elements. So all the things we'll learn, um, if we will learn till atomic number in this tutorial, after that I will make a separate video for the valencies as well as the electronic configuration. From there you can learn that. So let's get started. Before starting guys, I have a very small request to you all. If you are really liking my work, then please like, share and subscribe my channel, which will, which will motivate me to create more useful videos for you all. And don't forget to click on the bell icon to get the latest notification whenever I will upload a new video. And watch the video till end to learn the easy trick through Menomic. Okay. So now we'll start. Okay, in this slide, I will tell you the name of the elements along with their atomic number and the next slide will learn the monomic. Okay, so the first element is our hydrogen and it is having atomic number of 1. Second element is helium with atomic number 2. Third one is the lithium with atomic number 3. Fourth is beryllium with atomic number 4. Fifth one is boron with atomic number 5. And listen to the pronunciation of the elements also. And sixth one is our carbon with atomic number 6. Next is nitrogen with atomic number 7, 8th is oxygen with atomic number 8, Ninth one is fluorine, 10th is neon, 11th is sodium, 12th is magnesium, next is aluminium with atomic number 13, 14th is silicon, 15th is phosphorus, 16th is sulfur, 17th is chlorine, 18th is argon, 19 is potassium and 20 is calcium. Now let's have a quick look on the symbols, their symbols also. Hydrogen is having a symbol of H, capital H. Next one, helium is having a symbol of HE. H should be written in capital and E should be written in small letter. Uh, one more thing I want to tell you over here. Whenever you write a symbol with two letters, two alphabets are used. The first al alphabet is, is always written in capital letter and the second one will always be written in small letter. For example, lithium. lithium Lithium is having a symbol Li. Li is written in cap. L is written in capital and I in small. Beryllium is having a symbol of B. Boron is having a symbol of capital B. Carbon is having a symbol of C. Nitrogen is having a symbol of N. Oxygen is having a symbol O. Fluorine is having a symbol F. Neon is having a symbol Ne. Sy symbol of sodium is Na. Symbol of magnesium is Mg. Symbol of aluminium is Al. Symbol of silicon is Si. Symbol of phosphorus is P. Symbol of sulfur is S. Symbol of fluorine is Cl. Symbol of argon is Ar. And symbol of potassium is K. And the last one, calcium at with atomic number 28 is having a symbol of Ca. 
ओके सिंस फॉर वी कैन नॉट गिव द सिंबल ऑफ हीलियम एज एच बिकॉज वी कैन नॉट डिफ्रेंशिएट इट सो वी आर गिव द साइंटिस्ट हैव गिवन द सिंबल ऑफ हाइड्रोजन एज एच एंड द हीलियम हैज गिवन द सिंबल ऑफ एच ई लाइक दैट वी हैव टू एलिमेंट्स स्टार्टिंग विद द लेटर सी कार्बन एंड कैल्शियम कैल्शियम हैज गिवन अ सिंबल ऑफ सी बट कैल्शियम हैज गिवन अ सिंबल ऑफ सी ए ओके so according to their names they uh, the elements have given their symbol we will learn the order of the elements from 1 to 20 and also we will learn their symbols in the next slide so let's move towards the next slide okay this is the trick how we will learn the symbol of the first 20 elements of the periodic table through simple mnemonic okay in this i will tell you a story of two cute girls one is the little betty this she is a she is little betty and the next girl sitting behind her is the naughty maggie okay this is a story of a lit, um, they will help us to create this mnemonic so this is a story of a little betty and a naughty maggie you have to remember little betty naughty maggie okay so uh, now we'll read this mnemonic hi hello little betty's brother came now only from new york naughty maggie always sing popular song clapping around kitchen's cabinet this is the two line mnemonic which you have to memorize it first one is hi hello okay second one little betty's brother means she is betty her brother came now only from new york her brother came now only from new york she is naughty naughty maggie always sing popular songs clapping around kitchen's cabinet naughty maggie will always sing popular songs clapping she will clap around the kitchen's cabinet and she will sing the uh, sing the popular songs so this is our mnemonic once again we'll read this mnemonic hi hello little betty's brother came now only from new york naughty maggie always sing popular songs clapping around kitchen's cabinet this is the mnemonic okay now i will tell you how you will write the elements and their symbol see from here where the letters which i have uh, written in red color you have to focus on those letter hi from hi we will take the letter h h is the symbol of hydrogen next one he it is a symbol of helium hydrogen helium third one li li is a symbol of lithium hydrogen helium lithium beryllium b for boron c for carbon n for nitrogen o for oxygen f for fluorine n for neon n for sodium mg M G for magnesium, A L for aluminium, S I for silicon, P for phosphorus, S for sulfur, C L for chlorine, A R for argon, K for potassium, and C A for calcium. So all the elements are present in this mnemonic. You have to only remember this mnemonic, and you can write the name of the elements also and their symbol also. First, you have to write this mnemonic, or you have to remember this mnemonic. From there, you can take the elements and their symbols. okay once again i will tell you this one hydrogen helium lithium beryllium boron carbon nitrogen oxygen fluorine neon sodium magnesium aluminium silicon potassium sulfur chlorine argon potassium and calcium this is very easy guys you can learn this and it's a very uh, it's it will be fun for you to learn this one okay hi hello little betty's brother Hi, hello. Little Betty's brother came now only from New York. Naughty Maggie always sing popular songs, clapping around kitchen's cabinet. Okay, I hope you will learn this one, and you can easily, and you can, and then you can easily learn the elements of the periodic table. Now we'll move towards the second slide. Okay, in this slide, once again we will revise that mnemonic along with the names and the symbol of the elements. Okay. so we'll have a quick look on this one first i have made the three columns in this table we have the 10 elements in the next table we have the 10 elements first we'll take the 10 elements now from hydrogen to neon hydrogen is having atomic number 1 and neon is having atomic number of 10 we'll take all the elements okay first one hydrogen is having a symbol of h we have we have it first look at this mnemonic hi hello little betty's brother came now only from new york okay h for hydrogen h we have taken from over here helium is having a symbol of h e h e will take from hello lithium is having a symbol of li little from little will take li betty's b e for betty's beryllium is having a symbol of b boron is b symbol of boron is b from brother will take b came 
from C from uh, C will take carbon symbol C nitrogen having a symbol of N from the word now will take N oxygen is having a symbol O from the word only will take O fluorine is having a symbol B from the word from will take F and neon is having a symbol of any from the New York word will take any so this is the monomic to learn the first 10 elements hi hello little Betty's brother came now only from New York from there you can learn the learn the elements hydrogen helium lithium beryllium boron carbon nitrogen oxygen fluorine neon now we'll move to the next 10 elements from sodium to calcium sodium is having a atomic number of 11 and calcium is having an atomic number of 20 now we'll see this uh, monomic naughty maggie always sing popular song clapping around kitchen's cabinet okay now see this element sodium sodium is having a symbol of na sodium is having a symbol na from the word naughty we have taken na magnesium is having a symbol mg from the word maggie mg we have taken mg aluminium is having a symbol al from the word always we have taken al Sil silicon is having a symbol of si from the word sing we have taken the symbol si phosphorus is having a symbol p from the word popular we have taken p sulfur is having a symbol s from the word song we have taken s chlorine is having a symbol cl from the word clapping we have taken cl argon is having a symbol ar from the word around we have taken ar potassium is having a symbol of k from the word kitchen we have taken k and the last one calcium is having a symbol of ca we have taken ca from the word cabinet so this is the monomic to learn the first 20 elements of the periodic table i hope you all have understood this one how to learn and if you learn this monomic then you can write the name of the elements in series if you write the name of the elements in is series then you can easily write their atomic number from 1 to 20 for example how you will write this one hydrogen helium lithium beryllium first you have to remember the monomic after that you have to take the symbols from the from this word okay and from there you have to remember this one h is for hydrogen he for helium hydrogen helium lithium beryllium boron carbon nitrogen oxygen fluorine neon sodium magnesium aluminium silicon phosphorus sulfur chlorine argon potassium and calcium when you look at the symbols then you will easily remember their name when you look at the symbol b then you will you will remember that b is the symbol of boron when you look at the symbol mg then you will remember that mg is the symbol of magnesium when you look at the word na then you will remember that the symbol of that na is the symbol of sodium so for the most important thing is that you have to memorize this monomic after that you have to write the symbol and from there you can get the names as well as the atomic number I hope guys this is helpful for you. You will learn this one. If you are in class 8, 9, 10th, 10th please learn this. Uh, please learn the name symbols as well as the atomic number of the element. So that you will score good marks in the chemistry section. And this will be very useful for you till 10th standard. Till 10th if you will remember this all the things over there. Um, then you can score very good marks in the in your exam so it's important for you to learn the atomic number name of the elements as well as a symbol in the next video i will tell you how to write the electronic configurations from the atomic number of the elements and then we'll learn how to write the valencies of the elements and after that i will tell you how to write the formulas also suppose you want to write the formula of sodium sodium chloride then you should know the symbol of sodium and chlorine then only you can write this the formula of sodium chloride and after and um, symbol is not enough you should know the valencies also then only we can write the symbols of uh, then we then only we can write the formulas of the element so it's very important to know the basic concepts of chemistry small small things are there if you will know that one in future also it will be very useful for you if when you'll go in 11th standard then also it's very useful for you if you learn these things so please i request you all to learn the symbols as well as the atomic number of the elements from 1 to 20 okay thank you for watching my channel science learning gateway if this tutorial is helpful for you then share it with your friends also so that they will also learn the trick and also do like share and subscribe and don't forget to click on the bell icon to get notified and you can also connect me uh, connect me through my facebook page the link i will give in the des description box there also you can follow me on the facebook okay thank you